whatever you are doing with the Arduino is lost the moment you press the reset button or you remove the power. In here, I prepare a simple circuit for demonstration. Let's say you create a Wi-Fi bending machine. Then let's simulate that the customer inserts a coin. The customer insert a coin. Then, the customer press the start button. So, he is now using the internet. Start button. So, currently, he is using the internet. He can pause. And, he can continue. Maybe like that. Now, here is the problem. What if, what if, for an uncertain reason, the power is lost? Then, after a few moments, the power came back to normal. What will happen? The Arduino data is lost. Your customer will get angry. You will lose a valuable customer and of course, loss of income. To solve that, you can implement some data logging to an SD card or through the EEPROM. I just uploaded a new sketch to our Arduino. The sketch basically saves the current state of the LED to the EEPROM when the button is pressed and it reads the stored state of the LED during startup. So let's try again the simulation but this time with the Arduino EEPROM. Let's say the customer wants to connect to the internet so he insert a coin then he press the start button so he can start browsing the internet so for an unknown reason there is a power outage so the power is lost then after some time the power came back to normal. As you can see, the last state or the last status is being saved and being restored. So, EEPROM is a better and effective solution for data lagging. So, what is EEPROM? EEPROM stands for Electrically Erasable Programmable Read-Only Memory. Each EEPROM address can save one byte of data. Arduino Uno has 1,024 addressable positions while Arduino Mega has 4,096 addressable positions. EEPROM is effective solution for saving data but do not abuse the use of it. Why? The manufacturer specified an approximate of 100,000 write cycles for each address position. After that, it will begin to give weird results. But you can read as many times as you like without compromising its life expectancy. I hope you find this video as useful. Please like and share this video. If you have any question, please write it in the comment box. Please do not forget to subscribe. My name is George. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.